The Bishop of the African Church, retired Reverend Jeremiah Okunlola, has charged government at all levels to listen to the yearnings of Nigerian workers and meet their needs following the back and forth over the proposed new minimum wage. Bishop Okunlola made this known while speaking with journalists at a special thanksgiving of the Association of Nigerian Broadcasters following the inauguration of the National Executives held in Abelkuta, the Ogun State Capital. He said the demands of the workers are justifiable following the spike in the cost of essential commodities, amongst others, and is charged to the broadcasters. He challenged the members to uphold the truth and ethics of the profession at all times. On his part, the national president of the body said it will continue to play its role as the watchdog in the society with a call to the country's leadership to uphold fairness and justice at all times. Sincerely speaking, our governments who try and uh, uh, be considerate uh, with our people, they should listen to what uh, Nigeria are saying, either in words or in action. Everybody without missing word knows that things are not uh, the way it should be. The, 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 the cost of living is very high. And uh, what the labor are demanding for should be, is, is justified. It's, it's justifiable uh, when you look at uh, the rate at which things are very costly now. Uh, the government should please uh, listen to the demand of labor and at least do what will make uh, the general populace laugh and be happy. All Nigerians, let's be optimistic. We should be hopeful. We should be hopeful. We should be hopeful. And we should, all of us, try to contribute our quota to the change that we are expecting. You know, many people want change, but few people want to change. There is difference between people who want change and people who want to change. My message to the people at the end of affairs is that they should uphold fairness, equity, justice. When you do that, there will be peace in the land and also give the media opportunity to say something when we see something. We will do it in a professional way. So uphold justice, uphold transparency, and uphold humanity. That's my piece of advice for the people at the ends of affairs in Nigerian context.